All right, we're starting at the top. We're going to watch this guy just melt down when questioned about his beliefs. So it starts with uh, sensing and imagination and thinking as two different things, right? Uh, he thinks I'm a baller. Your senses don't tell you the earth is spinning. And I, he goes, uh, I think about what I know through my senses first. So he thinks about what he senses first. And I'm like, when you think about what you sense, that's called imagination. Nah, thinking is not necessarily imagination. Now, this is where he done fucked up because that's that's I know that's not true. Uh, I go, both are mental processes. Do you agree to that? Uh, and this is, look, and this is where he goes, so you admit your globe is your imagination. When did I bring up the globe? I never brought up the globe. I'm asking you about your, but you see how he, he could, he knew imagination and thinking are the same. Now, cause I can say, hey, right now, imagine a unicorn. Now, right now, think about a unicorn. What would be the difference? Nothing. So, and he knows that. So this is where he's like, oh, fuck, I got to I gotta find something else, right? So now he goes to the globe and calls me not very bright and way to boomerang myself in this face, which is ironically what he's just doing. And then me, you know, I'm just waiting for your answer. They're both mental processes. How are they different? And then he's like, oh, you lost. And now I just bring it back. So both thinking and imagination are mental processes, right? They're different mental processes, so what, how, how are they different? How do you tell the difference between somebody who's thinking and somebody who's using their imagination? And this is where he's just copium. Yeah, he, that's him. He's coping because he can't face his own beliefs. He thinks this, but he can't articulate why and how he thinks it. So he goes into cognitive dissonance because he believes thinking is not imagination. But then I can show that thinking is imagination. So he's holding two contrary beliefs. It's cognitive dissonance. You didn't run away. You won. How did you win? By saying they're different mental processes. But then how do you tell them apart? So, that, so that's where I go. So explain how they're different mental processes. You admitted right here, and we can screen cap it, that the globe is your imagination. <laughs> right? Like back to the globe to cope with the fact that he believes thinking and imagination are different, but they're not. And this is how he copes with everything in his life. This is how this is the this is the point of this debate. They cope with everything by attacking the ball clearly, as you can see.